this is one small gate valve let us see its wage this is the wage solid wage and removable type in single piece this wage is of taper section like this this wage is called solid wage in single piece this type of solid wage is used up to 4 inch size and up to 120 degree celsius temperature because at very high temperature or at low temperature when this wedge will sit inside the sit ring like this here inside the sit ring there will be thermal lock in that case it will be very difficult to close or open this solid wedge otherwise this solid wedge is widely used for all fluids and very much strengthy this is the solid wedge and this is taper like this and that is the seat inside seat that sitting surface is also taper where it sits like this like this but at very high temperature and low temperature due to differential thermal expansion and contraction there will be thermal locking and it will be difficult to open or close the valve at high temperature that's why this type of solid wedge is used normally up to 120 degree celsius temperature now this wedge arrangement is solid wedge this is the solid wedge and this is the sit ring this is solid wedge in case of solid wedge this solid wedge is made by casting or forging then in this taper set by machining in case of solid wedge this solid wedge is pressed in the body seat this seat during valve operation so this type of solid wedge is used for moderate and low temperature service not for higher temperature or lower temperature service because due to temperature fluctuation or at high temperature or low temperature this solid wedge may be seized and it will be difficult to open or close inside the seat rings for this reason this type of solid wedge gate valve is used up to a temperature of 120 degree celsius only this is one little bigger gate valve i have already removed this body bonnet bolt joints now let us see the wedge this is the wedge this is wedge this is also solid wedge and in taper shape like this this taper shape wedge sits over the taper shape body seat ring this is also removable like this this wedge is also solid wedge if we remove more material from the inner surface and make these two sides thinner then it will become flexible wedge this is taper body seat ring and these two are wedge guides and this taper wedge this is solid wedge sits over the taper seat ring like this this wedge design is flexible wedge
in this flexible wedge design majority of material is removed from the wedge inside like this so this wedge becomes flexible like this so this wedge sits in between body seat rings properly at high temperature and at low temperature because it is having some flexibility due to this elastic design of the flexible wedge it sits in the seat ring properly at high temperature and we get good leak tightness and it can be used as high temperature as well as at low temperature but the disadvantage is that if the fluid is corrosive then fluid will remain in this vacant area and in this area so that will corrode the wedge this wedge design is split wedge this is split wedge in this case two piece of wedge are there this is one piece and this is another piece and this is the stem one piece is concave like this and one piece is convex like this these two pieces are connected by a screw or nut bolt so when both the pieces sits in the body seat ring then one piece helps another piece to align inside the body seat ring this type of split wedge design can be used for high temperature high pressure and low temperature service this is one cryogenic gate valve this is the body bolted joint i have removed the bolting to see the wedge of this gate valve this is the wedge of the gate valve this wedge is split wedge in two parts this is one part and this is another part and these two parts are bolted here so when it fits in the seat ring this stepper part presses the other part this side against the seat ring and we get leak tightness so this wedge is called split wedge in two parts and one spring is there in between these two split wedge that's why this wedge is having some flexibility like this like this so this wedge can be called as split wedge as well as flexible wedge this type of split wedge or flexible wedge will have better leak tightness and can be used for very high temperature service and for very low temperature cryogenic service also and we will get very good leak tightness also since there is having flexibility we will get less friction while this type of split wedge sits inside the body seat ring now if we seat the body seat ring arrangement this side seat ring is straight and this side seat ring is tapered and these two are wedge guide so this tapper portion will have this face so it will sit like this through the wedge guide